Hey what's up guys, I met here and today we have the DT8 Ultra Max smartboard. It is sent by the DT number one official store. So you can check this retail store link given in the description box below if you are just a buyer like me. But if you are a wholesale seller and want to become a DT number one agent, you can find the link of their website in the description box below and become an agent of the DT number one in your country and enjoy many benefits given by them to their agents. I've already uploaded its full features and unboxing video but in this video we're going to dig deeper and talk about all of the features in detail and we will also talk about some of the exciting features which were not available at the time of unboxing so before we start make sure to hit the subscribe button to help me reach my next target of 20k subscribers so let's get right into it and talk about the latest edition in the dt8 series First of all if you look at the box it comes in a sealed box which is quite good so first of all let's open it and finally we have this new box which resembles the size of the original apple watch ultra and as you mentioned here it comes with two straps so let's open it so in the box we get this new style user manual then we have this box in which we get the two straps ocean straps and alpine loop then we have the wireless charger in it and in the end we have the dt8 ultra max so first of all we have a plastic wrap on it which is quite easy to remove we also have a protector on the sensors and then we have this wear pro branding and screen protector on the front also so here's the first look on the smartwatch the display quality and the sides quality looks quite good so first of all let's turn it on and we get this hello screen in the start if you look at the smartwatch it comes in 49 mm size it is compatible with the apple watch ultra case it fits it perfectly but if you look at the left side the additional holes and the speaker holes are on a little bit different location as compared to the original apple watch ultra the case color is not exactly the same as the apple watch ultra and gives a golden look i would say it also doesn't have the gps antenna design on the body and all of the additional holes and all the speaker holes look like they are open some of them are painted black but what matters is that all of them look open then if you look at the smartwatch it still doesn't have the insensible knob and you will feel a clicky sound whenever you use it then it does have a dedicated lock key and you can press the crown key to turn on the screen of dial or to turn off the display and it also has the app history function on the side button and on the action key by default we have the sport modes and you can go to settings and to side key settings to customize the function for it and on the back side we get wireless charging and health sensors and we also have the real skews and strap locks at the back the strap locks are real and the straps won't move from the original place you will have to press the button and then push the straps out to remove them so first of all here is how the orange ocean strap and the black alpine loop included in the box look on the smartwatch then the seller also added the new unity strap and the trail loop in three amazing colors which looks so good on the smartwatch so which one is your favorite let me know about it in the comment section below as advertised it uses the rtk 8762dk chip it has dual bluetooth with 5.0 version and uses separate connections for watch application and for bluetooth calling the product details doesn't mention the memory and ram of the smartwatch if you look at the display it is advertised to come with 2.1 inches of ips display with 420 into 485 resolution here is a look at the bezel size the bezels look even on these three sides but looks a little bit thicker on the bottom and i don't really think that the screen resolution is so high you will feel lagging while switching the watch faces and also while accessing this quick access menu page the scrolling is also not so smooth and with this dth ultra max i'm really impressed by many of the features that i'm going to address later in the video but the display really disappointed me the dth ultra max is given very high brightness and the display will be clearly visible in the daylight because of the high brightness display it also gets a torch application which can come in really handy sometimes and here it shows the full size of the display also if you look at the watch faces finally the dt series also has themed watch faces and interactive watch faces another thing that i really like about it is that you can press and hold on the display to lock the watch face so even if you use the crown key it won't change the watch face and we also get this red black compass watch face in the dt8 ultra max if you look at the watch faces the dt8 ultra max uses sweeping seconds hand after that if you talk about the screen of dial it comes with two screen of dials one with a digital clock and one with a pointer clock and one thing that really disappointed me is that it can only stay on for five seconds even though in the older dt8 models it could stay on for 30 seconds which was also bad as i think that the 
the screen of dial should stay on forever but they have downgraded this feature and it can only stay on for 5 seconds now. But if you talk about the normal screen time it has the keep bright option by which the display can stay on forever until the battery dies. It also has the tap to wake feature the display is always working even when it's sleeping. It does not have the palm gesture. So as I showed you, it comes with 11 menu styles. The icons are not similar to the Apple Watch OS. Even the app opening and quitting animations are not similar to Watch OS. In this honeycomb menu style, you can use the crown key to scroll all the way down to animate the icons and scroll all the way up to open the application which is in the middle. And there are many applications that are newly added in the DT8 Ultra Max that I really appreciate. First of all, this calendar application by which you can also access the calendar for the upcoming months and for the previous months. And it also comes with the compass application. Then it also has the time zone application now so let's check for asia and here it shows the correct time for pakistan right now and india is 30 minutes ahead of pakistan so here it shows the time of india and other countries as shown here and it also has the qibla direction now and currently it is showing the correct location of makkah in my room and as a muslim this application can really help me a lot for example wherever i go i can just use this application to see the qibla direction so i can offer the prayer easily then it also has the religious timing option here and it can also help me and other muslim users a lot so being a muslim i really appreciate these two applications added by the dt number one company this find phone option is also really helpful and the smartphone will start to ring so you can easily track it you will have to open the application and click on confirm to stop the smartphone from ringing. It comes with heart rate, ECG, blood pressure and blood oxygen level checker. And if you use any of the applications on the table, it will refuse to measure the data and will continuously give the error to please press firmly. It tells that it has working proximity sensor and wear detection. And I remember that the DT8 Ultra had the temperature checker but the DT8 Ultra Max doesn't come with a temperature checker. So you can also add alarms directly in the smartwatch. So let's set an alarm. So I've set an alarm for 1020 so let's wait for 15 seconds so the alarm doesn't have the snooze option and also doesn't ring it only vibrates and if you enable the do not disturb mode it does not show a moon icon on the watch faces another update that i really like in the dt8 ultra max is that in the control center you can click on this plus icon to edit the control center and you can delete menu options from here and also add them back from the bottom this new quick access menu also looks quite good it shows the battery percentage here is voice assistant then we have some of your health data including the day and date then your recent health tracking is shown here and we also have some other applications here and it has banner notifications now and you can tap on the notification to open it you can also scroll in the notification so the message I sent had four parts like this and it showed almost two parts of the notification and it also supports scrolling as you can see here it still doesn't support emojis and shows this weird text in Chinese when you receive emojis in a notification and it also shows a red dot at the top when you have an under notification it still doesn't have stacked notifications and shows the notifications like this in the messages application it comes with 380 mAh of battery inside it and the battery falls in intervals of 20 percent from 100 to 80 then to 60 and then to 40 and so on and i've been recording this video for about half an hour and it haven't gone down to 60 percent since then when i started recording the video the battery level was at 80 percent in my experience of using the dt smartwatches they've always given a great battery timing it also comes with the best Side clock mode so whenever you put your smartwatch on the charger it turns on and always on display with clock on it it uses the wear pro application and is detected as smartwatch the wear pro application has also gotten a redesign as advertised it comes with 500 plus watch faces available for totally free and we also have the my watch face section here now where you can see the purchase history as far as i have seen none of the watch faces are paid so the download history or the purchase history might only mean the watch faces you have downloaded you can click on this custom watch face button to use your own picture from the gallery that's a great update as the wear pro application can also use the picture dial now by which you can use a single picture from the gallery as the watch face and here we have gotten different digital clock styles and after selecting the style you can choose the location so this interface is quite similar to wear fit pro application then we have the album watch face by which you can use multiple pictures as your watch face and in the end we have the video dial option by which you can import a short video and use it as a watch face on your smartwatch
Another thing that I really like about it is that the app notification has the others option which means it can send you the notifications for almost all of the applications on your smartphone even if that application isn't listed here. You can also receive the incoming call notifications without having to connect Bluetooth calling. It also has the app store option now by which you can install these mentioned applications on the smartphones. It also shows the NFC guide here. Then you can also add up to 2000 frequently used contacts in the smartphones and you can also add a custom QR code in the smartwatch and in more you can select the reminder mode and other settings. It also has the GPS motion trajectory application by which you can record the path of your activity. It does have the music control application and it works without having to connect bluetooth calling. It also has the time application by which you can set the time without having to sync with the smartphone and you can also select the time format here. So guys this is all from today's video and from this GT8 Ultra Max. In my opinion it's a perfect replica but only misses a few things like a better display and a better UI. Why? Only if DT number one company can add these options, it will be one of the best Apple Watch Ultra replicas. But as of now, I think the display needs a huge improvement. But I do appreciate that they are working on the UI and also on the watch application. So if you would like to purchase it, I'm gonna be leaving the link in the description box below. And I would really appreciate if you can use that link to purchase the smart watch. You can also check out my best Apple Watch series 6, 7, 8 and Ultra replicas playlist. I'm gonna be linking it in the description box below. Make sure to hit the subscribe button to see more videos like like this and to help me reach my next goal of 20k subscribers i'll catch you in the next one until next time this is imad peace